today we've got another massive CGC return and we're gonna have a huge giveaway and we're gonna start with another iconic mystery box. Let's get into it. Hey everyone, welcome to the channel. We're just gonna start off with this VIP box. And if you remember, these are all hit cards. First edition Shadowless, Ghost Appearance, Tops Chrome, Shining Cards, the Gold Stars, the Crystal Hollows. So let's see what we could get in here. Last time we got the PSA 10 Nidoran Sparkle. Let's see what we can get this time. Okay, it's a PSA slab. It's a Japanese card. Definitely not a 10 judging from the back, but this is either a Crystal Hollow or Japanese No Rarity. Nice. Okay, let's start this off hot. All right, we have also pulled the Shining Mew. I have a feeling this is going to be the same grade as the last one. Or no, actually, this is probably worse than that one. The centering is abysmal. Let's give it a 7. N near Mint Mint 8. Okay, yep, we have pulled a PSA 8 Shining Mew from this box. But hey, great way to start it off. I, I always love this Shining Mew card. All right, let's hit it. Let's just get right into this. Be looking out for that giveaway slab tag, because there's going to be a lot of giveaway slabs today. So this is going to be awesome. Let's hit it. Pikachu Common from Crimson Invasion. You know how I feel about my Pikachus. I'm thinking a 9.5 on this one to start us off. Nine. Okay. Great way to start us off. I tend to always grade them. I very rarely don't grade a Pikachu because I just love the little guy. Yep, we had more than one of the Crimson Invasion Pikachus. I think this will be another nine. Yep, two mint nines. Sweet. I'll take it. It's the first time I've pulled that Pikachu in the Crimson Invasion. I didn't even know it was in there. So it's a pleasant surprise. I like the artwork on this one. We got the Pikachu from Burning Shadows this time. There are a lot of Pikachus in here, FYI. <laughs> I just love the guy. I think this is a 9 too. Ah, oh, okay. Near Mint Mint 8. Hmm, you know what? That is absolutely fine. Another Pikachu, <laughs> this time from Unbroken Bonds. A lot of these Pikachus I had pulled for the first time. I'm gonna go 9, 5, or 10 on this one. Whoa, 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 whoa. There's no way that's a near mint seven. Okay, there's our first uh, oddball of the bunch. There's no way. Hey, you take your shots. Arbok, reverse hollow from Temporal Forces. I love this artwork, so I had to take my shots with this one. This has got to be a 10. Gem in 10, there we go. Our first gem in 10 of the day. Excellent. The Kadabra Reverse Hollow from Twilight Masquerade. Love that they brought Kadabra back. I'm going with a 9 or 9.5 on this one. Okay, 9.5, nice. Again, another nice artwork from Twilight Masquerade. You know how much I love the Alakazam, so let's throw the Kadabra in there. The Scyther Reverse Hollow from Temporal Forces. Awesome artwork, action-packed, very cool. I'm gonna go with a 9 or 9.5. Eight, five, okay, that's all right. I was thinking on the cusp of a nine, so eight, five isn't the worst. I will definitely run with that. I just love this Scyther card. We have another one here, Scyther Reverse Hollow, Temporal Forces. This one has got to be a 10. Nine, okay, that's fine, very cool. We got a third one, Scyther Temporal Forces, Reverse Hollow. Come on, we gotta get one of these in a 10. This one's not a 10, this one's a nine, I think. Got the 10, we got a gem in 10 Scyther. I was hoping for that, I love this card. And another one yet again. <laughs> wow, I didn't think I had that many in here, but hey, another 10. Whoa. Okay, there is some edge wear, but I still don't think it's a seven. I think we're going a little crazy on that one. Hey, at least we got that one gem in 10. I won't complain about the seven. Charmander Reverse Hollow from Obsidian Flames. You know, I love my Charmander, Chameleon, and Charizard. I'm gonna guess a 9.5 or 10. 8.5, I guess that's okay. That's not too bad. So I'll take it, don't worry. There's plenty of hits in here too. <laughs> the Raichu Reverse Hollow from Temporal Forces. Love that one. I'm thinking a 9 or 9.5. Nine, 9, okay, that's what I was thinking. Very good, though. Love the Pikachu and Raichu and the Temporal Forces set. Great artworks. Okay, we did have another one. This one, I'm thinking, has got to be a 9.5 or a 10. 
eight, five. Hmm, all right, I won't complain too much. I think it could have been bumped up to a nine, but that's okay. We got the other one in a mint nine, so I'm fine with that. EV Reverse Hollow from Sun and Moon Base Set. Love the Reverse Hollow pattern on this card. The shine on it is beautiful. Cute little EV card here for the EV lovers. This one's an eight or eight five, I think. Eight five. All right, that's about right. No problem. Just love that EV. Pikachu Reverse Hollow from Paldea Evolved. Love this Pikachu. I'm thinking a nine five or a ten. It's got to be. Gem in 10, there we go. Yes, let's rack it up. So I'm pretty sure I have more of these in here. All right, yes, another one. Pikachu, Paldea Evolved, Reverse Hollow. This one I'm thinking is an eight, five or nine. Nine, five, okay, nice. We're getting high grades on this Pikachu. That lights me up. The Pikachu Reverse Hollow from Temporal Forces this time. Yes, there are tons of Pikachus in here if you haven't already guessed. Again, yeah, my favorite Pokemon. This one I think is an 8.5 or 9. 8.5. All right, guessed correctly on that one. Looks about right. Just love my Pikachus. Pikachu's my favorite overall, with Charizard being my favorite in the TCG. So, very close second with Charizard there. All right, another one, Pikachu Reverse Hollow Temporal Forces. This one's a 9.5 or a 10. It's got to be. 9, okay. I can deal with that. Not too far off. Haunter Reverse Hollow from Lost Origin. Very cool Haunter card in my opinion. Ooh, this one's close. But I'm thinking this one's more 9 or 9.5. 8. I think that's a little on the low side. I, I would have given it at least an 8.5 or a 9. But hey, it's it's not too bad. We'll go with it. Like the artwork on this one. The Reggie Rock Reverse Hollow Pokemon League card. This one's not gonna be a huge grade. I'm thinking eight or eight five on this one. Eight, okay. That's what I was thinking. It's a Pokemon League card. Just wanted to throw my hat in the ring and see how it does. Not too bad. First stack is up with this one. Lucario Reverse Hollow Rare from Burning Shadows. I'm a fan of Lucario, and this artwork's pretty cool. A5 or 9, I think. Or a 7-5. Yikes. I disagree with that one. That one's still a little low. I still think it could have gotten at least an 8-5. But you take your shots, and you'll live with the outcome. I am not going to complain. Second stack is up. 94 cards. Crazy. The Pikachu non-hollow from Temporal Forces. I think this one's an 8-5 or a 9. Gem Mint 10. Yes, the first one is a Gem Mint 10. Absolutely love this Pikachu. Non holo, reverse, whatever. And of course, another non holo Pikachu, Temporal Forces. This one I'm thinking is a 9 or 9.5. Nine, 9, okay. Sweet. 9s and 10s. Another one, yep, another non holo Pikachu. This has got to be a 9.5 or a 10. Gem Mint 10. Yes, a second one. That's what I like to see. See if we'll get any pristines in here. Another Temporal Forces non holo Pikachu. And again, this has got to be a 9, 5, or a 10. 9, okay. Not too far off. N 9s and 10s. Another one, I believe? Yeah. Yet another Pikachu, Temporal Forces. This one, it's going to be more an 8, 5, or 9, I think. 9, 5. <laughs> All right. In the non holo Pikachus, nothing less than a 9. Love it. Another non holo Pikachu. I'm going to guess a 9 or 9, 5. 8-5. Okay. There's a first one less than a 9, but that is okay. Not too far off. Now we move on to another Pikachu. <laughs> Pikachu day to day. The Pokemon Go Pikachu common card. I'm going 9-5 or 10 on this one. 8. Hmm. I think that's a little low, to be honest with you. Definitely think it could have been at least a 9, but got a bunch of these too, so we have plenty of chances to redeem ourselves. No problem. Sorry if you hate Pikachu. There's tons of them in here. I just love it. Another Pikachu Pokemon Go. This one is definitely a 9, 5, or a 10. No way it's lower than that. Gem in 10. There we go. <laughs> Knew there was one in there somewhere, so we get it on our second try. Excellent. See if we could snag more. Here's another one. 
Pikachu, Pokemon Go. Yeah, 9, 5, or 10. Another Gem Mint 10. There we go. Two of them. Nice. Love that. Let's get even more. Come on. All right, another Pikachu Pokemon Go. This one is more 9 or 9, 5, I think. Or freaking Gem Mint 10 again. All of them were Gem Mint 10 except one. I think there's still more. I sent in a bunch of those. Yep, here's another Pikachu from Pokemon Go. Again, 9, 5, or 10. Another freaking Gem Mint 10. This is insane, people. The one Pikachu that gets almost nothing but 10s. Love that. Another Pikachu Pokemon Go. 9, 5, or 10, I'm telling you. Oh, 8. Hmm. I'm thinking that one's a little too low there. This could have easily been a 9. But, hey, we got so many 10s, this hardly makes me cry. <laughs> so, I'm good. Another one, Pikachu Pokemon Go. <laughs> Gotta love it. Not 9, 5, or 10. Hey, another 8. Uh, I still think it could have gotten at least an 8-5. It's not too far off, so, hey, that's all right. Charmander common from Pokemon Go. And we got a bunch of these, too. <laughs> Don't worry. Trust me. There's hit cards in here, I promise. 9 or 9-5. Gem Mint 10, right off the bat. We get my boy Charmander in a Gem Mint 10. Love that i know a lot of people complain about pokemon go but i like the set call me crazy but I, I like it it's it's a small set it's got mostly my original 151 that i grew up with i like the artworks i like pokemon go <laughs> a slew of charmanders here's another one this one is definitely more nine or nine five eight five all right not too bad that's reasonable take it and guess what this one is <laughs> Boom, another Charmander from Pokemon Go. I think I sent in like, man, I don't know, like eight of them or something. This one's an eight or eight five, I think. Gem Mint 10. All right, hey, another Gem Mint 10. Another Charmander from Pokemon Go. I mean, nine, five or tens. Sit, what? Oh, wait, I see why. I doubt you'll be able to see it, but there is a line down through the entire card, like a huge crease down the middle of the card. You win some, you lose some. And another Charmander from Pokemon Go. This is a 9, 5, or 10. Gem in 10 again. Cannot go wrong. We are scoring nice. Another Charmander, Pokemon Go. 9, 5, or 10. It's gotta be. Another Gem Mint 10. Oh, you know you're getting some Gem Mint 10s today, people. Loving this. All right, another Charmander Pokemon Go. I'm going to go 8, 5, or 9 on this one. Gem Mint 10. I'll take it. Another Charmander Pokemon Go. 9 or 9, 5. Or another 10. Oh my gosh, people. We're getting so many 10s today. Love it. Let's just keep the show going with another Charmander from Pokemon Go. And this one, uh, 9 or 9, 5. 8, okay. I think that's a little low. I think it could have been an 8, 5, or 9, but it's not too far off, so no worries. Still no pristines yet. I believe there were two that I saw when I opened the submission, and one of them was Japanese and one of them was English. Another Charmander, Pokemon Go, thinking in a 9 or 9.5. An 8, okay. Still think it could have been an 8.5 at least, but no problem. Hey, we got so many 10s, I'm good. Another Charmander, Pokemon Go. <laughs> this one's an 8 or 8.5 for sure. 7.5 this time. Hmm, I mean the centering is pretty bad on the front. That is fine, we'll take it. Almost done with the second stack with another Charmander from Pokemon Go. 9, 5, or 10. Ge another Gem Mint 10. Ah, I love seeing that number, people. Last card in the second stack, and I believe it is our last Charmander. Yep, our last Charmander from Pokemon Go. This one will not be a crazy grade, but I'm gonna guess an 8 or 8, 5. 9, 5. I will take it. Not gonna complain about the grade going up. All right, stack three. Wow, let's keep the ball rolling with a Squirtle from Unbroken Bonds. Love me a Squirtle. This has got to be a 9, 5, or 10. Yes! That's what I'm talking about. Gem Mint 10 Squirtle. I'm psyched about that one. It's great artwork. 
first time I had seen the car, and, and you know how I feel about my original starters. Evie from Evolving Skies. I'm thinking of 9.5 or 10. Yes! Yes! That's what I'm talking about. Gem Mint 10. Gotta love the Eevee and the Eeveelutions. This is going super well. Blastoise Hollow Rare from Pokemon Go. I believe we have a couple of these in here. I'm thinking of 9 or 9.5. 8.5. All right. I think it could have been bumped up a little bit, but it's not too far off, so I'm I'm good with that. I'm good with that grade because we've got another one. Let's see what we can do. All right. This is probably the second one. Yes. The second Blastoise Hollow Rare from Pokemon Go. And nope, definitely not a 10. I'm thinking an 8.5 or 9. 9. Okay. Love this Blastoise card. Have never pulled the Radiant Blastoise from Pokemon Go. I've pulled the Radiant Charizard and the Radiant Venusaur. Never the Radiant Blastoise. Maybe someday. Radiant Jirachi from Silver Tempest. Gotta love the Sword and Shield Radiant cards. You know what? This could be a 9, 5, or a 10. Come on. 9. Okay. I'm good with that. I will take that. Very nice. I guess it went with the rarities, so it started out with all the commons and uncommons and stuff, and I guess now we're moving into the hollows and the hit cards, so we'll see if that's the way it falls. Yep, Baxcalibur Shiny Rare from Paldean Fates. Love the new Shiny Rares. I'm thinking 9 or 9.5 nine on this one. 9. All right. Great card. Love those Shinies. Ooh, our first pristine 10. We're just gonna flip this, see what it is. One, two, three. Wabam! Oh, nice! Radiant Steelix. That is a nice pristine 10. Sweet! Arctivish V from Evolving Skies. Why not? Hey, it's Evolving Skies for crying out loud. This could be a 9, 5, or a 10. 9. Okay, cool. We'll take it. It's a random Pokemon, but why not? Who cares? <laughs> Now we're getting into all our hollows and hits and all that stuff. Nice. Haldeo GX from Unified Minds. Beautiful artwork on this card. You know, I think it's at least an 8, 5, or 9. No freaking way. Gem Mint 10. That's what I was hoping for. Beautiful card. Unified Minds. Love that. Now we're getting into some really exciting stuff. Come on, let's keep it up. Lucario V from Astral Radiance. I'm thinking an 8.5 or 9. 8. All right, I will take it. That's reasonable. Rayquaza V from Crown Zenith. Definitely a fan of Rayquaza as well. Has some awesome artworks. I'm going to go bold and say a 9.5 or 10. 8.5. All right, I think that's reasonable. Got to just try your hand. Leafeon V-Star, Crown Zenith. This has got to be a 9, 5, or a 10. Yes! Gemmin 10. Love that. Schoolboy Full Art from Fusion Strike. I'm gonna go so far as to say a 7, 5, or an 8. A 9? Really? Hey, they gave me a 9. I ain't gonna question it. Definitely gonna take that. Professor Seda's Vitality Full art. I'm thinking a 9.5 or a 10. Gem in 10. Nice. Awesome full art. Very nice. Lolan Executor V full art from Pokemon Go. I think we might have a couple of these in here. Yeah, I'm thinking this one's uh, 8 or 8.5. Gem in 10. None too shabby. Cool. And this must be our second one. Yep, our second Alolan Exeggutor V Full Art from Pokemon Go. This looks exactly the same as the other one. I'm going 9, 5, or 10. Gem in 10. Two Gem in 10 Alolan Exeggutor Vs. Nice. All right. Torterra EX Full Art from Temporal Forces. Like the artwork on this one. This could be a 9, 5, or a 10. Yes! Gem in 10. Awesome. Man, we are scoring big with the hit cards. What's up next? Agron VMAX from Brilliant Stars. Really cool card. I like this one. Yeah, I don't know. The VMAXs are always hard for me to judge, but I'm going to go with a 9 or 9.5. 9. 
Nine five. All right, sweet, right on the money. Very cool artwork on this one. And our second pristine 10. One, two, three, boom. The Aspathra Art Rare from Future Flash. No problem. Hey, I will take that. Love the art rares. Two very nice pristine 10 cards. Sweet. Aspathra Illustration Rare, Paradox Rift, 9, 5, or 10. 10, nice. Both the Spathras in a 10 with one pristine. Sand Dial Illustration Rare from Scarlet and Violet Base. I'm gonna go 8, 5, or 9 on this one. Seven, yikes. That's way too low. I would have given it at least an eight, but that's all right. You do what you can do. Squavit illustration rare from Scarlet and Violet base set. I'm going, yeah, seven, seven, five on this one. Eight, five. Okay. All right, looking it back over, that's a fair grade. Very good. The Palmot Illustration Rare Scarlet and Violet Base Set. First time I had pulled this one. I'm going bold and guessing 9, 5, or 10. 8, 5. I think it could have gotten at least to 9, but hey, that's all right. Melanie Galarian Gallery Full Art from Crown Xena. This one is looking nice. 9, 5, or 10 is what I'm guessing. Gem Mint, and there we go. Love those Galarian Gallery cards. Got the Gem Mint. Sweet. Toxtricity Galarian Gallery Full Art from Crown Zenith. Love this artwork. I gotta go with a 9, 5, or 10. 9, all right. Yeah, that's good. That's good. Not too far off. Very fair grade. Last slab in the third stack. Hisuian Samurai V Star Galarian Gallery from Crown Zenith. Awesome artwork. I gotta go with a 9, 5, or 10. Yes! Yes, that is awesome. Glaring Gallery V-Star. Love those V-Stars. All right, last stack. See what we can come up with. Pikachu Evolving Skies. Back to my Pikachus. 9, 5, or 10? Yes! I am really excited about this one. First time I had pulled this Evolving Skies Pikachu. Didn't even know it was in the set. And I get the Gem Mint 10 on it. Love that artwork. I'm really excited about that one. Dragonite Reverse Hollow Rare from Silver Tempest. I mean, again, 9, 5, or 10. Yes! That's what I'm talking about. Another freaking Gem Mint 10. We are killing it. Regice Hollow Rare from Crimson Invasion. This one I'm thinking is an 8, 5, or a 9. Mint 9. All right. Right on the money. Very nice. A modern Japanese card. The Marowak Hollow from Japanese 151. Gotta be a nine or nine five. An eight. That is way off. I do not agree with that grade in the slightest. Should have been at least a nine. Oh well, hey. What can you do? For Alligator Hollow, Temporal Forces. Cool artwork. I mean, nine five or 10. Gem in 10, there we go, right off the bat. Cool card, like this hollow. We have multiple of the fur alligators. I'm not sure how many, but here's another one. I mean, a nine, five or 10, nine, five. Dude, we're doing great with the fur alligators so far. Nice, this is another one. Yes, another fur alligator, nine, five or 10, come on. Gem in 10, nine fives and tens across the board with the fur alligator hollow, love that. Another for alligator hollow. And again, nine, five or 10? Nine, no problem. Still good. Nines to tens is all we're snagging with this guy. I think that was all the for alligators. Nope, oh, nope, I was wrong. Here's another hollow. I mean, nine, five or 10? Nine, five. We are killing it. Loving this. That I'm pretty sure was the last one. I don't think I sent in too many of those. Here's my guy, the Hisuian Arcanine Hollow from Twilight Masquerade. You know how much I love this one. It's got to be a 9, 5, or a 10. Gem in 10. This is great. I love this. This is one of my favorite Scarlet and Violet Hollows, period. All right, let's keep it going. There was only one of those. Articuno Hollow Rare from Silver Tempest. Also the first time I had pulled this one. I'm thinking 9 or 9, 5 on this guy. Eight, five. Okay, yeah, I looked it over and, that, and that's fair. Love my legendary birds. Getting close. Galarian Moltres Hollow, Evolving Skies. Nine or nine, five. 
nine. All right, love this car. Cool artwork. I like the Galarian version of Moltres. Zapdos Hollow Rare from Pokemon Go. This is gonna be an eight, five, or nine. Nine, all right, and right on the money. Very good. Love this Zapdos. Again, I, I'm a fan of Pokemon Go. Call me crazy. I think we might've had two of those. I'm not sure, let's see. Yep, we do have another Zapdos Hollow. Yeah, this is a nine, five, or 10. How? I definitely disagree with that one. There is nothing wrong here. This should have been a nine or nine, five, but hey, take it or leave it. Nothing to whine about. Oh, there were three of the hollow Zapdosis. I still think a nine or nine, five. Nine, all right, there we go. We'll take that, excellent. Alakazam hollow rare from Twilight Masquerade. Also one of my favorite scarlet and violet hollows. I mean, nine, five or 10. Gem Mint 10, there we go. Gem Mint 10, Hisuian Arcanine, and Alakazam. I think we might have more than one, I'm not sure. Uh, oh, no, it's the Snorlax Hollow from Vivid Voltage. Love Snorlax. I'm gonna be conservative and guess a nine or nine, five. Nine, all right, yep, that is fair. I just love this artwork, it's simple. I don't know, I, I just like it. Four slabs left, it's ended on a high note. Gyarados Hollow from Paldea Evolved. Yes, the rest are Gyarados. I have four of them in here. So let's see how many tens we can snag of my boy Gyarados. We're gonna start off with a nine or nine five. Eight. I think it's a little low. At least an eight five I think would have been reasonable, but that's not too bad, so I'll, I'll accept that grade, no problem. I mean, we got three more of them in here, so we're gonna snag our 10. Another Gyarados. Yeah, this one's an eight or eight, five for sure. Eight, five, all right, right on the money with that one. I just love this Gyarados. Here's our third one. This one is a nine, five or a 10. It's gotta be, come on, eight. Okay, yeah, this one I 100% disagree with. Definitely should have been up there in the 9s and 10s. But what can you do? <laughs> Let's just end it on the last Gyarados. Let's give it a better grade. Let's end it on a high note. This has got to be a 9, 5, or a 10. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. That's how we want to end this. That was massive. I hope you all enjoyed it. These are all of the slabs that are going to one of you lucky subscribers out there. So be sure you're subscribed to the channel and leave a comment down below saying what your favorite slab of today's reveal is to enter the giveaway. Thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you on the next one.